<laughs> All right, hey, you guys, what's up, you guys? You guys want to know how to take off a valve spring without having to take the cylinder head off? Check this out. Get some rope, show them on the inside right here. Get some rope, shove it inside the piston, the cylinder, I mean. Just get it down there, all right? Get a whole bunch of rope and just shove it down there like that. Okay, bring it up here. Now that you got rope in there, now bring this piston to top dead center. Watch this, keep it on that. So bring that piston all the way up to top dead center, right about there. That's where all the rope is smashing, right there. The rope on the inside now is smashing up against the bottom of the valve, okay? So now this is what you do, this is the trick. I wanna take this off, all, all four of these right now, all right? But I'm just gonna take this one off. Get a magnet, bust it up, put it on the inside of a socket that fits the outside of this, the same diameter, all right? Get it on like this, then what you're gonna do is hit it, all right? Show me hitting this right here. Then you're gonna hit it like this, watch this. You might have to hit it a few times. Check it out, one is out, one of the keepers are out already. Like that, let's push this down a little bit. Make sure the magnet stays at the bottom. See, there's one keeper right there. So put this back on. One keeper stuck in there still. Ready? Just like that. See that? So now we got it off. See how easy that is? See how quick it is? All you gotta do is use rope. The reason why you gotta use the rope is that way this valve doesn't fall inside the cylinder. Okay, and right now, it's stuck right now, right there in position because we got the rope so tied up against it. Anyways, that's the old school trick right there. It goes way back to the old school days. That's how you handle that. Go get it.